This is the Normal Nerds Podcast, where two very normal dudes talk about very nerdy stuff. And we also feel like talking about. I'm your host, Professor Chaos. And I'm your host, who redeemed himself at Flip Cup, Davis Bates. This episode, we're talking about the best drinking games. So sit back, relax, and welcome to the Normal Nerds Podcast. <laughs> All right, Davis. Yo. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween, and happy Halloween to you too, viewers. Yes. Uh, as I said at the top of the episode, I am uh, Professor Chaos. And I am Monkey D. Luffy, captain of the Straw Hat Pirates. You did it. Yes. I don't know. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> uh, yes, I did do it. I had, did it. I ordered uh, it off of Amazon. <laughs> we had a Halloween party over the weekend. Yeah. Um, went very well. Thank you to everyone who came. Uh, it was yeah, a good time. It was a blast. But, we played uh, Penalty Pong, Beer Pong, and we played some Flip Cup and Cheers Governor. So we're here to talk about some of the best drinking games that exist. Yep. Yep. And also, just for a quick side note, uh, so for all the viewers who uh, may not know, I, last year at Halloween, was horrible at Flip Cup. I lost, my, I lost several games for our team, but this year, I did not. I actually managed to get the cup within... Three tries each time. I was, like, I, was like, I was paying attention to it every single time. I was like, you were pretty okay. You were pretty okay. Uh, exactly. And I take that to be full-on redemption. I hate cloaks. Nerds, I don't know how you work cloaks. <laughs> yes, I had full-on redemption this year. I'm so happy. It was so good. I thank God I was not the worst one at the table this time. I was so happy about that. They're That's gonna, true. You definitely weren't. I, I definitely weren't. What are you? <laughs> Get a straw or something. <laughs> at least do it on camera. I don't see it. Yeah, that really didn't work. Anyways, so yes, we're gonna talk some of the best drink games. Are we yes. talking? Are we, you know, uh, do you have a you have your top three? Top three, top three, top three. No, you go first. Okay. Are we doing top three? Is that what we're doing? Let's do top three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. That's a better uh, idea okay. than I had. Yeah. Uh, number three for me would have to be uh, Flip Cup. I'm a big fan of Flip Cup. Mm-hmm. I think it's a fun game. Um, it's a fun group game. It's easy to do. It's team based, or you cannot do a team based. It makes you drink a lot, I realize. Yeah. It gets you really drunk pretty fast. Um, that's probably my number three. Number two is beer pong. Even though beer pong can be incredibly boring and yeah. nobody wants to do it sometimes. Yeah. but I had, it is like, I had a game last night that was like, yeah, I oh wanted God, it to end forever. so bad. We spent uh, half an hour shooting at one cup on each side. It was horrible. Yeah. Um, but it's like a party staple that you have to do. Mm-hmm. And I don't know. It's just it's a, it's a needed one. It's yeah. a needed one. And it's so basic. I like it. I like it too. It doesn't take a lot to do it. Yeah. Uh, and then my number one is called um, Beer Ball. Okay, right, you have to explain that to me and the viewers. I don't know, and the viewers, maybe to you. But, Go fuck um, yourself. So how I'm works, trying to make a good pod- podcast here. How it works is you have uh, you know you're on a rectangular table. You got a beer can in front of you. Your partner has a beer can in front of them mm-hmm. on the corner. Two people on the other side, beer can mm-hmm. in front of them in the corners. In the middle is a cup full of water. One person takes a turn. They throw a ping pong ball at the opposing team's can. If it hits it, mm-hmm. they start to chug their can until the opposing team gets the ping pong ball and puts it back in the water. Okay, okay. It is the best fucking game. It is super <laughs> intense. It's high flying. It's like one of the few drinking games I actually can think of where the goal is to drink. Okay. Like even though we've got every other drinking game, even yeah, yeah, up, try, it's yeah. like you're trying to get like, someone else to drink, usually. Yeah, you're trying to get someone else, or it's like a negative of the game. Like yeah. this, you're like, oh my god, drink, come on, drink it. Like, drink as much as you can. Yeah. Um, and it's super intense. It gets, it's a lot, it's a lot, a lot of fun. Yeah. But nice. it's only one of those games. So usually, uh, you know, the rules of drinking games is usually when you win, mm-hmm. you stay on the table. Mm-hmm. This game, it literally takes like 10 minutes, mm-hmm. and you chug an entire beer. So if you stay on the table like three times in a row, you're like, yeah, okay. okay. I'm good. Yep. <laughs> get yep. me off this yeah, I'm done. Pass, yeah. pass, pass. But those are probably my top three. Nice, nice, nice. All right. So my top three. I think I Party can... drinking games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. What's the difference? What else would there be? Well, there's like drinking games you can just do when you're like hanging out with your friends. Oh, yeah. Well, no, no. We're not, we're not, we're not sitting around. Yeah, we're not doing like stuff where we're like sitting around the table. No, 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 no. Uh, these, are all, these are all in party. some way games, you know, party. party games or they have an objective to them or something like that. I mean, I consider card like card party games like drinking games you know yeah i wouldn't consider asshole oh. okay well that okay uh so my list is gonna change a little um that's not like a party drinking game oh, okay what was the okay, you really one? need people to focus on that one yeah so it's like five people first of all a party is at least 10 people okay 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 all right fair enough fair enough uh yeah, fair beyond enough. that it's like a kickback it's less than fair like kickback enough uh in that case 
One second, one second, one second. I'm trying, trying to remember the name. I'm just trying to remember the name of the one. I know. I know I came up with this idea, too. I was trying to think of the name of the one that I had. Uh, it was... What do you do? Uh, you... Uh, oh, no. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got okay, it. Okay, okay, okay. So, my number three game is Thunderstruck. I think oh. Thunderstruck is it's a basic bitch game for a college kids who just want to get tanked. And you can do it with multiple songs. And for any of you who don't know what it is, but I'm sure everyone does, you play this. Everyone stands in a circle with a drink. You play the song Thunderstruck, and every time the word Thunderstruck is said, someone starts drinking, and then when it's said, Thunderstruck is said again, it moves to the next person, and then so on and so forth until the song is over. And usually, one person or two have gotten ridiculously screwed. Well, there's and are yeah, trash. isn't there like one where it's like he says it, and then it's like a really long exactly. Yeah, you don't want that one. You're like trying to like you're just you don't want it. But it, it's one of those. It's such a simple game, and if forces some people to drink like i just said there's some i've had friends that like you know play like drinking games and all that stuff but they never really like get into it or anything mm. like that but this is like this is the one where it's like hey, it's stuck on you heather you have to drink now ah. uh, was someone specific. Uh, she's a friend of mine but uh, <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know if she actually played thunderstruck but she's just the first one that came to mind when i mm. thought about it um so that's my number three and it's such a basic game and it's so easy to do and i love it and everyone gets jazzed by playing it usually yeah. okay. so thunderstruck is there um my second one is flip cup that was, you know, just especially after the last. The, I've only played Flip Cup a few times in my life, but every time I've done it, it shows. It's it fuck you. <laughs> it's intense AF. People are shouting. People are. If you have the right people, of course. Yeah. Uh, but it usually gets the entire party going, and especially last night. Oh it was my right, God, it, last like night, it kickstarted Evan, our party last night. When Evan got like that one final one, I feel like it was like such a like. It was like a tight back and forth. And yeah. We kept losing a million times. Our team sucked. Yeah. We were, um, we were but bad. when he got that one, I was like, oh. Yes, oh it was God. amazing. Yes, and we were like, and it's great because then you can just shout to the other side and make them fuck. It. Like if you got someone who's like real jumpy and jittery over there, they'll oh, yeah. fuck up good. It was, and it's it was awesome. a lot of fun yelling. Yeah, it was, like, you suck, you suck, you're bad, you're bad, trash, trash, trash. Mm. Uh, so I really enjoy doing that. I love shit talking. It's one of the best. Oh, it's the best. It's Chirping the best all day. Chirping is great. And then my number one game. Um, and this is actually a recent one. Uh, that we learned about is landmine. Oh yeah, that I love landmine. I think it, it was actually one of my fa- so far. It is my favorite drinking game I've ever played. That game was um, a shit ton of fun. So the, there's a lot of there's some rules in landmine, and I don't know if I'll be able to explain it super Just well. Simple rules. Simple rules. Okay, so everyone has like two shot glasses of beer in front of them, and they have a beer can. And so the idea is you spin a quarter, and you have to drink those two shots of beer as fast as you can. Three? No, two. it's two. It's two. Yeah, it's two. You can fuck me up, man. I, I, I'm not going to rule explaining as it is. Let other people do this. Ah. Uh, so what was I saying? So you do so two shots of beer, and you got to finish. And once you finish that, and you pick back, pick the quarter back up before it's done spinning. You're good. But if the quarter stops at all in that time, you have to finish your shots of um, beer and then refill it and try again until you can successfully complete it. Uh, if you finish your beer can, you now have a landmine, which means someone can start spinning the quarter and they just and you take your beer can, it's a landmine, you slam it down on the quarter, stop it, and then they have to, so same rules, they have to then, you know, finish their two shots, refill it, and try again. And then now there's an obstruction of the beer can, because it stays on the table, yeah. in their way. And it is a fucking blast. We drank, we played it with five people, and we literally had to, we burned through a 30 round oh, in the span of an fuck, hour, uh, maybe. We had, that. I had to go and get more beer, and I was... Not sober walking to get that beer. I oh, like really? st- I like tripped a little bit. Yeah, oh, that's fine. I yeah. was like, oh god, we oh god. Up, yeah. We were yeah. so we fucked up because I was because ch- you can. Uh, fun little part of the rule is that you can take. So when it's not your turn spinning it, you can take your beer can and if it's like half full or full or whatever, you can chug it and then you have a free landmine. And then you just like uh, that was dangerous for me because I can I can when I need to chug I can. And I was like, oh no. <laughs> so I it got was... fucked on that uh, game. You all right? What? I forgot to put our Halloween decorations up. Oh, it's all right. We got the skull still. We're fine. We'll live. I think we'll live. I think I think I think we went above and beyond already yeah, for this Halloween awesome. episode. I think we can live without the lights for a second. Uh, yeah. No, I yeah was so I was like, I was like, something feels off. Uh, yeah. Well, we're getting ready for November as, as it is. You know, yeah. this is the last send out. You know, this is a nice little bridge into November. Yeah, you know, yeah. we have the Halloween and then we have the November stuff. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. So it's going to be. So it was that game is amazing. Uh, if nobody, if you guys really want to learn about it look it up or dm us i'll send you like a full list of rules that i actually know and can explain then but god it was such a fun game and just it's a great party game for like people to it was both it was just i don't know it was so intense and chill at the same time oh it was great i think i think when it comes down to these like the main thing is who you're playing with yeah it's true yes yeah, if you're playing with those people i hate okay 
if you're overly try hard, no one likes you. Yes. If you're like getting aggressive, it's like, all right. Yeah. Chill. However, if you're that person who's like, I don't really care if I win, you're the worst. Don't play. If yeah, you don't, don't care play. at all, don't play. Yeah. Get out Let of here. Just us don't play. play the fun people. Yeah. We're having a good time. We're yeah. here for a little competition and play you know, some fun. Of course, yes. No one is trying. No one's taking home, like, you know, a trophy at the end of this. We're just all trying to get smashed faced. You know, oh, let's yeah, go. Yeah. Let's go. And, like, yeah, I, I like to win. I think it's a lot of fun. And I think, like, when you're. You know, sometimes like I think like if you're fun competitive, like like it's it's a blast. Like, yeah, it's know? a really really like, good time. I feel like that's football. We were just like it was so competitive. Oh my like, god, yeah. Teams, and and we like, had what, eight like, people on a team at one point. It was wild. Yeah, a good time. we were going. It awesome. Yeah, it's intense and it's great. Yeah, it was a good time. But uh, another good party game. You were trying to say asshole. Asshole is a great game. Asshole is a really fun yeah, game. So, um, so is I don't think we've done it while drinking, but I think you could, can't you uh, drink and play hearts at the same time too. I mean, I guess. You could, yeah. I mean, yeah you can way. do that with yeah. You can drink and do anything. Yeah, facts. I guess that's facts. You can yeah, yeah. drive machinery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or vehicles. As much as it annoys me because I had to play it so much when I was in college, uh, King's Cup is a decent game. It's a pretty good one. But yeah, it's, it's such a one. basic game these days. I don't know. I'm just, I'm very, I've played King's Cup, King's Cup so many times in my life. And by, there are just people out there who always suggest it. And it's like, guys, get a different game. No one fucking cares anymore. And there's always an argument about the, what the numbers mean and what the rules are. It's like, <laughs> This is such not worth it. Yeah. It's so not worth it. Um, what we do have to do. It's funny. Because I forgot about, I forgot that, because when my, my buddy came over last night and reminded me, we made Drunk Django when I was in college, oh, and we need, we need to make yeah. that again. Yeah, yeah that, that's, that's a, such, a, that thing got us like shit-faced and we did it. That's anyway, so Drunk Django is when you write rules on the Django pieces. Whoever pulls it out has to read the rule, and then the rule is instated. And it is so much fun. Whoever knocks it down finishes their drink. That's a good one. That's a good one. Yeah. Um, slap cup, always good. Yeah. Or stack cup. Very messy games, though. Stack Cup is so messy. Yeah, so Slap Cup is even messier. Um, uh, I'm trying to think of other drinking games I used to play all the time. Power Hour is always a great game. I don't know Power Hour. What's that one? What? I, mean, <laughs> I just told you I played Drunk Jenga mostly in um, college. Yeah. Uh, it's just it's usually a game to get the night started, but it ends up getting like you just start drinking too much. Uh, you just you pretty much either have to take a shot of beer or take a sip every minute in an hour. Okay. And it doesn't sound like a lot, uh, but it starts to become a lot. Yeah, after a, a while. After a while, yeah. I gotcha, I gotcha. Okay, nice. Nice. Yeah, so uh, that's a good one. Uh, I'm trying to think. I mean, I played a lot of drinking games. Uh, beer pong has changed way too much. Uh, people are ridiculous now with beer pong. Oh, my God. Um, there's so many different rules. And you everything. fucking kids. I don't know what this... Like, last time we were playing, and uh, Bree shot it, and it, like, hit one cup, like, and then, like, fell into another one. And the guy's like, oh, that's two. I was like, no, it's fucking not. That's one. I don't know what this oh, BS2 wait, shit. what? No, yeah, so it tapped a cup. No, I was like, okay, imagine this is the, this is the, I know that, I know this already is a rule. Like okay. That, that the, I don't know if you did it, the younger people do it. The p ping pong ball hit this, yep. like, rim, and then fell into this cup. Yeah. And they're like, that's both those cups. And I'm like, yeah, no, it's fucking two. not. What? No, it's not. Yeah, if you're a pussy, it's two. You guys suck at beer pong, so you started making up this BS rules where you get like what is it? It rolls across cups, and now it counts for all of them. No, it doesn't. Yeah, what? It counts as the cup it falls into. That's it. Or you what? bounce it, and it counts for two. What is this like BS that you made up? Because you guys suck at beer pong, so you gotta like. What's in here, old timer? Yeah, get out. Times of here. change. Yeah, get out of here. Get Living out of in here. the past, old man. Get out of here. They tried to do that last night. I was like, no. I said no. Of course like, you did. Of course you did. Dude, there's too many rules. Like, the kids are like, add rules. What are the rules? There's, they add rules all the time. The rules are simple. It's just like, because we used to do the rules? we used to do beer pong tournaments back in high rules? school. What are the rules? <laughs> um, we used to do beer pong tournaments back in high school. And uh, when I hosted it, I was like, guys, we're just doing simple fucking rules. We're not doing like all this like, you, see, you know, ring of fire. Uh... No, you don't. No. Okay. Uh, it's like another way you can win. The There's like all these weird rules. So it's like you bounce it, it's two. You make it, it's one. Okay. If you make three in a row, you're on fire. You get it back. You both okay. make it, you get it back. Okay. And you can do islands or isos, whatever you call them. Why do you That's call them it. isos? I never understood that one. Isolation, as it's by uh, itself. Ah, I see. I feel like island makes more sense. I call it island now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I call it, I call it like here, here or there. Okay. Know, all right. Depends on the group, I guess. Yeah. Depends if you all are 100 years old. Or first, young, of all, first of all, you're kiddo. like you're like eight in partying age. I don't go fuck. Yeah. <laughs> still, still younger than you, old man. <laughs> you, you, I think have partied. I partied. I have. Mm -hmm. I have. I just, I'm sorry, I haven't played all your million drinking games. I was just getting smashed by my own. And then throwing up. 
Oh yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. I'll tell you, no, I partied. I to, went the hardest. Um, there was a there's Mario Party drinking. That's a lot of fun. Mm, I mean, I've done. I got that. really nice. fucked nice, up yeah. in that. Mar- Burial Kart is a lot of fun too. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think of other games that I've played. I played so many fucking drinking games. Oh, hundred percent. That ring what? game. It's not an actual game, but it's a game we play at my buddy's cabin where there's that ring. Oh, you ever take that game? It's oh, on a string, and you have to like toss it, and it's got to land on a hook. So we made that into a drink game. Uh, one bachelor party, we went out there, and it is fun as fuck. Yeah, and it messes you up. Oh yeah, we were destroyed. Oh my god, yeah, that was. And you were in crutches too. I was on crutches. I yeah, I there was at some point where I'm pretty sure I tried walking on my leg. It was very very drunk. It was. It was I was in a full on cast, so and I tried walking on it. It's just it that like, ridiculous. We get with like all the stuff you got to put on. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we had the yeah. rules and all that shit. Yeah, rule making is such a good thing in drinking games. It's so much fun. Oh, right, cheers, governor. We played that last night. That's a good one. Count to yeah. twenty one, then you make all these rules. Uh, we yeah. used to call it. Uh, we, I, I knew the crowd last night. Oh yeah. So uh, my group of friends, we didn't call it Cheers Governor. We call it Go America. Ah uh, <laughs> yes, I don't think that would have landed too well no. last night with some of the people that were there. <laughs> yeah, no. So. Oh yeah, yeah. But uh, also last night, uh, I mean, not last uh, last night, yeah. Uh, for some reason, uh, we did a drinking game of wall sits. Your boy won with his friggin' awesome quads. Yep, yep. Let's go, Pirate King. You did lose the, you did lose the push-up competition. Yeah, but who fucking cares about that? I knew you were going to lose. I also did push-ups that day already for my workout, so. Also, I mean, Manny weighs like six pounds. <laughs> yeah, that's fact. He, was, he is considerably lighter than I am. He's a small person. I am, I am very muscular. I don't know. Shut the fuck very, up! Shut the fuck up! I'm very uh, muscular. I would say you're muscular, but very I'm muscular. I don't think I don't, I don't think either of us are very muscular. Um, well, I am. You're not muscular. You kind of got spaghetti arms, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I brought that up to Michael last night, and since Evan was there, and Evan was like, <laughs> Michael's like, well, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, you're an idiot. <laughs> your trainer, Evan. Yeah, yeah. 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 I was like, yeah, Evan. Thanks. <laughs> thanks for defending me. Thanks for defending me, Dad. <laughs> yeah, uh, but drinking games are fun. Oh, yeah, uh, drinking is fun, but you know, drink responsibly. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I don't know if we have to say that, but we're just gonna say it. We're gonna say it anyways. But always have fun. Thank you, Normal Nerd Nation, for listening and maybe even watching another podcast episode. Make sure you follow us on Twitter, Reddit, YouTube, and Instagram. Davis is always posting hilarious memes on there. Also, like and subscribe while you're at it, and leave a rating if you have some time. It helps people find the show.